Guys, these have gotten so huge since I first planted them. I got to do a lot of cleanup on them. Like here, cut those off. But they turned out nice. They're doing really good. They got huge. I was skeptical about planting these in pots up front at first, but I really like how it came out. It looks really nice. I think I'm going to do them again next year. This is just some of the front yard. My hibiscus, I can't wait for them to bloom. This fountain has to go because it, the hibiscus and this hydrangea just completely took over it. And then I have my other can of musafolia. No, this is the banana, banana ansati, ansati, I believe, or something like that. But it started out pretty bad. It was like this. I pulled some off. And then I fertilize it with um, coffee grounds and um, ash from my fire pit. And then it started doing good. So, because those are really heavy feeders. This is all around the front. Never really show the front like that, but. The little elephant ears. These hydrangeas was here when I moved in. That one. And then this one down here. But we put this here, but it's just kind of leaning. I don't know. I'm going to have to trim that one up. And it just kind of goes around to the side. All the way around. So that completes the front of the house. As you can see, I love hydrangeas. I just think they're so pretty. They have them everywhere. But, yep. Oh, and my trees. I just did hostas on each side, and then these um, caladiums. This caladium gets more sun than that one. And they kind of turned it a different color. They were the same when I got them. They turned different colors. This one has more white in it than that one does. But, yeah. So that concludes the front.